on today's episode of Billing an RC Car. What is up ladies and gentlemen, I will be showing you the designing process of the gearbox but if you're not interested you can skip ahead to the electronics and the further explanations. To get started with the RC car, there are six electronic components that are required, which are the controller to send information to the receiver, which then relays that information to said component. Then the servo, which controls the steering, the battery to power the electronics, and the ESC to send PWM signals to the motor, which then converts electrical energy into mechanical energy. And boy, can I say the motor is an absolute unit. I mean, just listen to the gearbox. Alright, now that you've seen the gearbox in action, I want to talk to you about the next steps. Attach this. Move the end piece. Oh, crap. The end piece here. You can see how rotating this will affect the wheel right here. Now, this is a CV joint, which is a problem for me, which I don't like. But that's okay. And that's good. So what I'm gonna have to design now is the, I forget what you call them. This concludes video number one. I've got the motor set and the electronics. The electronics weren't difficult at all. It did come with the, the wires actually soldered upwards. So I had to desolder them. But the solder was crap. It was like that cheap shit they use. So I actually had to add better solder, which is 60-40 by the way. Remember that guys? 60-40 is the king <laughs> in electronics. Yeah, let it free stuff. See you guys in the next one. Next video will be the back part, which is going to be the full complete set. And I'm going to actually talk about suspensions and all that, so <laughs> fun.